I am not particularly opposed to joining an occult group. It's for myself, I'm a Luciferian. I have been for a number of years. I'm not opposed to joining a group. As a matter of fact, here recently I've been looking for a group to join. But a lot of groups out there don't click with me. There's so much nonsense out there. I was reading something. Let me see if I can find it again. I'll be looking for it while I'm... This is my old-ass HTC Thunderbolt from Verizon, back when I had Verizon as my primary carrier. And now, since the whole NSA nonsense has come out, I think Verizon can go, well, they can go commit certain acts of sexual frustration upon themselves. Because, I mean, I, I just feel like they should have fought, or at least tried to fight that, and the NSA probing, you know, snooping, they, sh they should have at least tried made an effort to somehow, you know, instead they just went locks, they just went in locked up with it. Uh, I'm still kind of looking for this. So anyway, I had a question for the occult people out there, because since I can't seem to find a group that fits me or, you know, or, or has ideals I could come to accept, what should I do? What do you think I should do? Should I just keep, you know, doing what I'm doing, or should I actually try to start my own group? Which I I have been given the the latter some thought, but the thing is, obviously I can't run a whole group myself. You know, I need a couple of co-founding members, and there were some people. There's there are some people out there that are just obsessed with this real church idea, you know, you know, Satanists need a real church to go to, you know, we need this real church, no you don't, that, that whole craze, that, that creates more problems than it solves, and I think a lot of that evolves around, involves, I think a lot of that has to do with pen, penis envy, because they, they see the Christians, and they see the Muslims, and they see the Jews, they have these, they have their own structures, and they go there, and I think that's what that has more to do with. A lot of people have tried to say, well, no, 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 we're trying, we're manifesting. <laughs> you're manifesting a laundry list of fucking problems you're going to have to deal with later. That's all the fuck you're doing. But, uh, I heard it said somewhere. Chaos magic is one of my favorite things. I'm a Luciferian. Have been for about five years. Chaos magic is one of my favorite things to work with. I heard it said somewhere, and this is what I'm trying to find here. And it's one of those things that I, I don't, click with, I don't know if all Chaos ma Mages believe this, I don't know if everybody believes, if the Luciferian believes this, but I heard it said somewhere by supposedly an occultist, because I don't particularly know the guy, but he said one of the things about Chaos Magic is there is no such thing as absolute truth. Now, you have to understand, I'm a very orthodox thinker, and that statement seems self-invalidating to me, to say the least. If there are no, if there is no such thing as absolute truth, that is itself an absolute truth. So, you know, just little things like that. Plus, I'm kind of opposed to personal drug use. To, excuse me, recreational drug use. I'm not saying drugs should be illegal. I'm just saying people shouldn't do it. You know. I could probably go shove a brass fitting up my ass. That doesn't mean I should. You know what I mean? <laughs> anyway. So, I, I can't find it. So, what do you think I should do? Should I just keep doing what I'm doing? Or should I try to start my own, you know, make my own website, start my own group, or what have you? If you think I should, let me know if you're interested in being a founding member. You know, I'll toss some... You and I will get together somehow, either online or... Most likely online. We'll, we'll we'll try to chat and we'll bullshit or whatever. See what we can... We'll just throw it against the wall and see what sticks. Alright. Anyway. That's it for this. See you later. Bye.